Hey ladies, welcome back to my channel. We are back with another Amazon wig install and today's wig is from You Nice Hair Amazon. Today I'm showing you guys their Bye Bye Knots 7x5 Lace Closure Glueless Wig. Now this lace does come pre-cut, pre-plucked, and pre-bleached and the knots are pretty invisible and that lace is very thin which we love. As you guys can see it is a beautiful body wave texture that is 150% density, 24 inches, and 100% human hair and the color is a beautiful chestnut brown ombre. I love this wig, it looks super pretty. Now this wig is definitely beginner friendly you guys the install was very simple very easy and it does come pre-styled for you so the curls are already there but I did go ahead and recurl the hair on camera you guys know how I am I just like fresh curls but if you're in a rush and you just need something to throw on really quick this is one of those wigs that you can use and this is the perfect everyday wig as well so as always i'm going to give you a quick unboxing they do send a lot of goodies along with the wig i'm going to give you some close-ups of this color this texture the lace etc also i just noticed that i said this was a body wave texture this is a loose wave texture you guys so it's still kind of similar to a body wave but the curls are a lot looser my mistake <laughs> so anyways let's go ahead and get started i'm just going to add some foundation all over this lace per the usual and then i'm going to throw her on make sure everything is centered make sure everything is secure now per usual the wig cap was a little big on me so i did use a little bit of spray you guys spray is optional you do not have to use it if you do not want to this wig is meant to be installed without spray or glue however you guys know that sometimes adding spray helps to lace out a little bit more and in my case i just needed a little bit more security since the wig hat was a little big on me So I wanted to show you guys where the lace ends. Where my fingers are is where the lace ends. It's a seven by five lace closure. So it's seven inches across and five inches back. So there is a lot of lace room. However, I'm sure you guys can see that my natural edges come out farther than where the lace was cut. So unfortunately, I will be sticking to a middle part because of that. I do not want my natural edges to show and I will also be adding some baby hairs to this wig and you guys will see that in a few that's you know my issue i kind of have this issue every single time when it comes to pre-cut lace wigs they're just not properly designed for my natural hairline and i'm okay with it i just work my way around it so i'm done with the lace now i'm just giving you guys a close-up now honestly the edges of the lace could have been a little bit more blended in now that i'm looking at it i feel like certain ways that i turn my head you can see it in other ways you can't so just keep that in mind you guys when you are installing however the lace was pretty thin and i did like the color as well and i did not see any of those black dots so they did a really good job with the pre-bleaching now as you guys saw the wig does come pre-curled and this is what it looks like after it's brushed out it still looks very pretty however i prefer fresh curls so i will be going in with my curling wand and to help out with some of the flyaways i will be using my wax stick as well the shedding on this wig was very minimal and I did not have any tangling and I did not smell any type of crazy smell the hair also did not change colors nor burn as I was using the heat it worked very well so I don't have any complaints about the hair quality overall I don't have any complaints about the lace the only complaint that I have is that I wish this was 180% density instead of 150 but she still came out very pretty
so we are done curling the hair so now I'm just going to run my fingers through her and get some of that volume back So we are basically done you guys. I just kept running my fingers through the hair wherever I felt like it. Now if you want some more volume you can definitely cut some layers. Look at me over here showing my boyfriend my hair. Giving him a little attitude or whatever. He was hyping me up in the background. <laughs> but yes if you would like more volume than this you can definitely add some layers. You guys know that I do that pretty often. I just decided not to do that with this wig just to kind of just give you guys an even more simpler tutorial because not everybody knows how to cut layers not everybody wants to do all of that so I just wanted to show you guys what you can do to this wig unit straight out the box I didn't wash her or anything like that this was a straight out the box wig install you guys so comment down below let me know what you guys think about it I think it's really pretty of course and even though she is 150% density it's still giving a little bit of volume but trust me, if it was 180% density, this would have looked even more gorgeous. So, you nice hair, I need you guys to make this one in 180% density, okay? Make sure you guys check out my description box down below. Everything will be listed there, including the direct link to this wig. Thank you so much for tuning in. I will see you guys next time.